in this video we shall discuss how to um, set up two DNS server and two web server okay uh, click on servers here click on bind DNS server um, actually I won't be able to um, demonstrate the full thing to you for because because I don't have four web servers uh, I mean four servers now as I was saying I don't have four servers with me um, for my one computer I can make uh, two servers but then uh, the problem would arise which I'm going to show you actually okay now let's begin um, okay the, there should be two DNS servers and two web servers okay um, let me um, start paint here paint okay it's coming up minimize it a bit let's fit it okay 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 let's assume we have one dns server here and the uh, web server here and the web server here another dns server here this is dns uh, server this is also dns server this is dns1 primary dns server and this is dns2 secondary dns server and um, this is my main web server and this is my child web server uh, like okay uh, my primary dns server that is my primary primary dns server is this one uh, this would um, store this is to the main job actually and secondary dns server will just be a copy of the primary dns server okay with this set let's create master zone okay uh, there are two dns server here as i said so this would be dns one and this would be dns2 dns2 forgive my drawing please okay let's get a domain let's say one dot one and the master server instead of writing dns i shall write dns1 dot one dot com okay and the email address if email address as you want this will doesn't change then to complete then in the address field um give your web servers address there are two web servers okay assuming you want to create the main servers okay okay let's come let's jump to paint now again uh suppose the okay increase the font, uh, font is okay okay so here okay suppose the site name is fun.com fun.com this is the main site and this is the child domain let's say um contact contact dot fun dot com okay and this is the main domain this is the child domain fun dot com contact at fun dot com okay now let's come here and drag give the ip address one nine two one one six give you okay now let's assume the ip address of this web server okay the ip address of this web server is let's say dot two zero three okay let's click create and for the child domain it's contact okay and it's 
IP address. Uh, let's uh, this one was point two zero three and for this one it's let's say point two zero five. The last byte that is one nine two two zero five. Okay, then click create and as we write here dns in dns hri dns1 okay and its ip address let's say dns one ip address let's say point two zero zero the last byte point two zero zero so it will be this one only and we should write we have to give another entry dns2 and suppose the IP address of the DNS2 is point let's say 100 zero zero, the last byte uh, set 200 zero zero, it's 100 zero zero. click create ok this is done and click, uh, click on decision to record types click on name server um, Um, keep the zone name blank and click on name server and write dns2 dot one dot com okay and followed by a dot the dot is very important you should never ever at this dot and click create and click one dot com one dot com default Okay, install and click on return to zone list and click on start name server and apply changes. Okay, now something uh, has to be done here. Go to a network, uh, network thing, uh, network and sharing center, and click on VM and net one or your LAN connection, whatever it might be, and properties. Uh, setting has to be done okay this is your IP address this is your primary DNS IP address and this is secondary DNS IP address you must give both of them the primary DNS is DNS 1 and secondary DNS is DNS 2 both must be given and you must click ok then uh, it's done otherwise this step would be incomplete ok apply changes Okay, I'm going to open index. Then go to send mail. Oh, sorry, no send mail. Networking, sorry, yeah, networking. Network configuration. Click on hostname and DNS. This should be your DNS. One IP address is six eight point eight zero point two hundred. And the next one should be your DNS two IP address one nine two point one six eight point eight zero point one hundred. Then click save. So this is also done. Then click on apply configuration. This is done. Click on web main index. <coughs> this is job for uh, job for primary DNS server. Now let me show you for secondary DNS server. Bind DNS instead of create master zone, you must like create slave zone. Okay, then domain name or network. Now, domain name means the domain name that's fun.com. Yeah, this fun.com and master server get DNS one's IP address. Okay, DNS one's IP address one nine two one six eight point eight zero point. 200 and click create so you create this one in the access um, okay this is because i'm creating on the same server that's why uh, if you are created on different server it would have been done probably okay this is the thing is different let's talk the same just need to keep in mind that um you must uh, fill up this one actually make a compilation this is the same 
thank you for this tutorial if you like it do like and do share thank you